To search dimensions, just enter a keyword in the search box at the top of the page and press enter. This will search for the keyword in all five data types, publications, grants, patents, clinical trials, and policy documents. And you can switch between these results by clicking on them, as shown here. The filters on the left side can be used to filter to just certain entities of interest, such as funder, country, or research organization. Filtering for more than one of these using an OR relationship can be done by selecting the organizations and then clicking on limits to at the bottom of the page. If you want to search using an AND relationship, this can be done by clicking the limit to next to the entity, as shown here. You can also search by pasting an abstract. Simply select abstract search, paste in the text and press enter and Dimensions will automatically identify results based on the contents. Results lists in Dimensions can be sorted by different features, such as by citation count in this example. Clicking on any document title leads to the document detail page, which as well as containing all of the basic information, also lists the other documents and Dimensions which are connected to it. In this case, there are many linked publications through references and citations, as well as funded grants which led to the work, and patents and policy documents which have cited it. Many publications in Dimensions have direct full-text PDFs available by clicking on the View PDF button. This opens the ReadCube Enhanced PDF Viewer, allowing you to directly access the reference and figure lists and many other interactive features. You can also download the PDF, and if you have a ReadCube account, you can add it to your library. If you'd like more details about ReadCube and the Enhanced PDF, please go to readcube.com. Publications in Dimensions have citation information displayed within the Dimensions badge. Clicking on the badge gives you all of this information in more detail. Dimensions badges are also openly available for non-commercial use, so that you can embed them on your own internal website or publication pages. There is also the Altmetric badge with the Altmetric Attention Score, indicating the level of attention that this article has attracted from across the internet. Again, clicking on the badge takes you to a details page with all of the details for you to examine, including news articles, social media and policy document mentions, and many others. For more information on the Altmetric Attention Score, please go to altmetric.com. Once you have your main results list, the Analytical Views area can help you analyze this. The Overview tab shows you a trend in the results over time and each of the other areas of the analytical views will group the results in your list by that tab, such as the area of research as defined by the fields of research system, the source title when in publications, funders that funded the work, or research organization affiliated with the work. In any of these tabs, any entity can simply be clicked on to add it to the search definition to filter the initial results list. At the bottom of the list of tabs, there is also the compare feature, allowing direct comparison between two research organizations around the world, broken down by research category. Searches in Dimensions can be saved as favorites or exported to CSV or Excel file by clicking on the button at the side of the search box. You also have the option of exporting for bibliometric mapping. This will export a file which is designed to be imported into the openly available VOS viewer in order to visualize your results in networks based on co-citation, organizational affiliation, or other parameter. This simple to use tool makes it extremely easy to produce visual analyses for reports for even the least technical of users. When you use dimensions outside of your university domain, all you will be able to see is the publicly available Dimensions version. This contains limited filters and only has the publication's data. If you have problems or questions while using Dimensions, you can go to the Support Center to access the FAQs, or click on Send Feedback to get in contact with us.